Commanders! Right now you can participate in our May event called Lilac and Steel and win a number of prizes. One of which is a new premium tank destroyer called SU-152 Turan or Object 120. Today we'll tell you more about it. The development of Object 120 started in 1957 right at the dawn of the anti-tank guided missile era. A decision had to be made regarding the future of the entire vehicle class. Would there be a place for a gun-based tank killer on the battlefield, or would all such future vehicles carry ATGMs? At that point, the tank destroyer class was designed with a range of at least 2 kilometers in mind, which meant that the gun would have to be incredibly powerful. That's why most of the actual development focused specifically on the armaments. In Armored Warfare, the SU-152 Tauron is a Tier 5 Premium Tank Destroyer. You can obtain it for free, all you have to do is complete the event objectives. Gameplay-wise, the Tauron is a classic TD with excellent gun penetration and damage per shot value, courtesy of the 152mm smoothbore cannon called M69. However, the reload time of 10 seconds is quite high. The gun can fire two types of shells, kinetic and high explosive. The damage per minute value reaches 4,380 units with the kinetic shells and 5,850 units with the high explosive shells. On the other hand, the other parameters of this vehicle won't be as great. The steel armor will protect the vehicle only against machine guns and some autocannons. Its diesel engine will only allow for average mobility with the maximum speed being 63.4 kilometers per hour although the vehicle will have the override active ability available, which increases its maximum speed temporarily. Additionally, if you want to fire at a distance without being immediately noticed, the zero inactive ability will allow you to do just that, if only for a limited time. In order to perform well with this vehicle, you'll have to stay out of sight of the enemy. The key to success is driving from cover, dealing extreme damage with one shot, and move to a different position. This TD will require immaculate knowledge of the battlefield, a careful hand, and experience. What do you think of the new SU-152 Tauron TD? Tell us in the comments below and don't forget to press the like button and subscribe to our channel in order not to miss on other awesome content. See you on the battlefield!